What is up everybody and welcome back. Uh, last time we faced the gym trainers and in this part we're gonna face the gym leader Misty. So yeah, I know it's been a while since we saw gym leader, but we finally get to fight one now since we brought Misty back to her gym in the last few videos. But uh, anyways, before we, before we fight Misty, uh, just really quick, you probably, in this video, you'll probably notice that um, I evolved my Magneton, finally. <laughs> so, yeah, I did that on Christmas Day. I traded, I used my cousin's DS and brought my Pokemon Diamond game with me and, uh, traded it to Pokemon Diamond and evolved, uh, Magneton from there. And now it's finally a Magnezone. Now, its special attack is actually really good, so, yeah. Anyways, uh, now that, uh, that's over with, we can fight Misty now. So yeah, well, I'm really looking forward to my Magnezone. Um, yeah, he, she was expecting me. <laughs> yeah, right, I mean, were you really expecting me at all? I bet you weren't. Uh, anyways, uh, Misty is a type of gym leader that I like to, uh, excuse me, about, uh, but yeah, Misty is a type of gym leader that likes to, um, confuse you, freeze you, and put you to sleep. So, yeah, that's really annoying. Let me turn the audio up a little bit. I think it may be a little too low, so... Yeah, I turned it up. I turned it up. So, uh... Misty will send out a gold duck at level 49. And those moves Water Pulse, Disable, Psych Up, and Psychic. So, yeah, uh... This Pokemon shouldn't really be a threat to you at all. If you do have an electric or glass type, like I said in the other video, um, you shouldn't have too many problems in this gym at all. So, yeah, I'll get the glass types dominate this gym. So, yeah. Uh, next up is Quagsire. Uh, I'm gonna go into my Frogator. Okay, so, uh, we, we're going into a Frogator. She sends out a Quagsire at level 49. And those moves, uh, with Water Pulse and these, uh, earth pa earth, uh, or not earth power, Earthquake and Rain Dance. Sorry about that. Uh, now, I know this thing will take forever to kill, so I'm just gonna give this, uh, shout out in this video. I'm gonna give out three today. Uh, the first shout out will go to Ultra Pokemon 1222. Um, he is doing, uh, he, he's doing Fire Energy for Green Challenge. He, he, it's not actually a walkthrough, but. It's a knockoff challenge, so yeah, he's doing really good with that. And then, uh, the next thing that he's doing is Pokemon Black and White 2 Walkthrough. Uh, yeah, Pokemon Black and White 2 Walkthrough, which is awesome. I'm actually looking forward to that, I'm watch and I'm watching that a lot, so, yeah. So, yeah, uh, that's the first shout-out. So, uh, the next shout-out will go to the Nitro 1, and he is doing a, uh, still doing Heart Gold. Still doing pretty good on it. Uh, I'm gonna go for a punch, but yeah, she's gonna full score. But uh, yeah, he on the natural one is doing hard gold. He's uh, after his fifth in that now, I believe, and he has a pretty good team. Yeah, no, stuff hasn't really changed much for him, so yeah. He's actually he's actually gained a lot of subscribers, so yeah. I'm just looking out for new videos from him. And then the uh, last shout out will go to uh, Legendary Lucario 11. He is doing a Pokemon Platinum walkthrough. He used to be, he used to be uh, a sexy shadow, but he decided to quit his channel for some reason. And then, uh, yeah, he's doing Pokemon Platinum. Uh, I don't know what he's going to pick for the story yet. I'm getting some stuff. So yeah, that's the sh that's, uh, that, that's the sh today's shout out. So if you want uh, some shoutouts, just leave a comment below. So yeah. Anyways, uh, now that the quag side is down, next up is Lapras. Uh, just keep this in mind. Uh, I'm gonna go to my manga zone. Yeah, but yeah. What you have to keep in mind is uh, if the quag the quag side. Uh, yeah. Now it has a move Amnesia, and then now Amnesia is a move where uh, it can. Uh, uh, higher the special defense by two stages. Now, just because of that, I'd recommend that you stick to your physical attacks on it, not special attacks on Quagsire. But, uh, next up is Lapras. I killed the Quagsire with my Frogator. So, Lapras is at level 52. Um, and that was the move Water Pulse, 
Sing, Ice Beam, and Body Slam. So I'm gonna use Flash Cannon to try, try out my new move. Because I don't think Thunderbolt can quite kill it, even though I'm, even though I'm holding a magnet, but yeah, I'm pretty sure Thunderbolt won't kill it unless I get a crazy glory or something. So yeah, I definitely love the animation of Flash Cannon. Flash Cannon is just awesome, so yeah. Okay, uh, I'm gonna force store my, uh, Magnezone, so yeah, I better not call him a Magneton, because he evolved. Yeah, but I evolved it, so, yeah. But if you can tell by my voice, I think I'm still a little bit sick, I'm not sure. But I probably did recover from my cold, uh, so, yeah. So yeah, Water Pulse is, Water Pulse is really annoying, because it can confuse you. See, see what? See, what did I tell you? What did I tell you? Misty likes to put you to sleep. See, so that's just annoying. But yeah, I'm just gonna get a full heal so I don't have to deal with the whole uh, sleeping thing. Uh, let's see, where's my full heal? Oh, uh, here's my full heal. Uh, we're gonna heal a Magnezone. Alright, so it goes for a Water Pulse. Uh, it's gonna do the same amount of damage that it did before. Uh, I'm gonna finish this thing off with a Thunderbolt, and okay, I don't know how this thing is faster than me because I, I think I outsped it earlier. And perfect. I'm glad I didn't get confused. Okay, so this Lapis is gonna go down 100%. I'm sure of that. And next up, uh, is Stormy. I'm gonna stay in with my Magna, Magna Zone, even though, uh, it's up to a 28 HP and won't survive any of me that the Stormy uses. But, uh, the Stormy is at level 54, uh, it knows the moves Water Pulse, Confuse Ray, Recover, and Ice Beam. Now, uh, keep this in mind, once this thing is at, like, at low health, it will just try to use Recover, or Misty will might use a potion, or not. But yeah, just keep that in mind, uh, Stormy just like to use recover. And Ice, Ice Beam can freeze you because, uh, has a 10%. Okay, excuse me. Has a 10% chance of doing that, so, yeah. Uh, but Stormy, uh, knows the moves Water Pulse, Confuse Rate, Recover, and Ice Beam, so, yeah, that's the movesets of the Stormy. Now, I think I can, uh, kill this thing in one hit with, uh, Thunder Thunderbolt, so, yeah. Right, come on. No. Okay, I just hit confusion. Like, I get so unlucky with confusion each time it hits me. Like, seriously. Yeah, that's the annoying thing of Water Pulse. It just confuses you by like a 20% chance. So, yeah, right, come on, come on. Yes, perfect. So, yeah, uh, that was a really good battle against Misty. Uh, I know this is going to be a KO, so. Yeah, that's Misty. Uh, not a bad gym leader. So, yeah, uh, she's actually a really strong gym leader, so don't underestimate her, so, yeah. Yep, it is it. Yep, I am really good. And we are also skilled, and we're gonna get a uh, 12th gym badge, the Cascade badge. And then we're gonna get uh, the TM for Water Pulse, it's a really good move. Uh, well, it's not that good of a move at this point in the game, because it's not that powerful, but the good thing about it is, it has a 20% chance of, uh, confusing the foe. So yeah, it's a really good, uh, well, not that good at this point in the game, like I said before. So you probably don't want to teach that move anyways, since it's like, at this point in the game. And we are now certified trainer, certified trainers. And, uh, yeah, that was a really good battle against, uh, Misty. So, now that we defeated Misty, uh, I'm gonna ignore the call. It's so annoying when people call me. Uh, but yeah, now that we defeated Misty, uh, I'm gonna go he I'm gonna go heal. And then, uh, next time we're gonna be facing the gym leader Sabrina. Finally, because I think, uh, I trained really good, so. Next time we're gonna be facing Sabrina. And I'll meet you in Saffron City. So I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.